Thanks, yet another warning today about what can happen after a stroke. Health anchor Liz Bonus joins us now with the surprising results of a new study. Liz? Hey Sydney, hey Brad, once again, we, tell, we took a look at this new study and took it to the TriHealth Chief of Neurosciences, who's also now part of the Mayfield Brain and Spine Center. It was published out of Texas A&M, and it suggests that those who have a stroke may have an increased preference for alcohol. Now, some research shows that more than two drinks a day is a risk factor for having a stroke. But after you have a stroke, many times it's advised that you limit your alcohol intake to prevent a second stroke. This new study, however, found that the changes in the brain may increase what's called alcohol-seeking behavior and may even lead to a greater preference for alcohol. The behavioral changes as a consequence of strokes in very specific parts of the brain can alter that behavior and perhaps remove impulse control that uh, would be otherwise helpful. Isn't that interesting? Like, we're just delicate beings. Yes, <laughs> and it's, it's a very complex wiring that, uh, that we have upstairs. Uh, I think uh, probably the grand designer himself is the only one who really understands it completely. Agreed. Dr. Ringer says what is now needed is more research to know if this change is a permanent one or it diminishes with time. This was a lab study. We need to do follow-up studies now in people to know if the same is true. The message here is if someone you know has had a stroke, and we definitely are seeing these in younger people, some that are healthy, watch for changes. You know you know what that person's drinking habits were before. Yep. Something goes haywire. You know, it might be just that something's changed in the brain. Right. So interesting. That's what I thought too. I thought, my goodness, you know, the fact that it would be an injury to the brain, and if it's alcohol, what else might you say? Because you'll hear people say quite often, it changed something in them. You know, they got angry sooner, or they had different habits. And is it addiction in general, or is it specific right, to alcohol? Too, and we don't know. This is kind of one of the first studies, because it was an early lab study. Mm -hmm. But we'll be following, and we'll bring it to you. All We're right. back at 6 to talk to you a little bit more about some healthy babies. All right, All right. Thank you.